some taste. Yeah, you guys just need to hit the playground and play like you should and just stay away from it. Shalom. This is Ray Bash's Torah Thoughts for Kids, and this is Parasha number 24, Vayikra, He Called, taken from Leviticus chapter 1, verse 1, all the way to chapter 5, verse 26. This Torah portion is all about the sacrifices to God. Leviticus chapter 1, verses 2 through 4 says, Speak to the Israelites and say to them, When anyone among you brings an offering unto the Lord, bring as your offering an animal from either the herd or the flock. If the offering is a burnt offering from the herd, you are to offer a male without defect. You must present it at the entrance to the tent of meeting so that it will be acceptable to the Lord. You are to lay your hand on the head of the burnt offering and it will be accepted on your behalf to make atonement for you. Back in the days of the tabernacle and the temple, people used to bring animal sacrifices to the priests, and the blood from the animals covered their sins, bad things that they have done against God's rules, which we call the Torah, until the next time they sinned. However, Yeshua the Messiah came, and He was sacrificed on our behalf, and because He never sinned, His blood took away our sins instead of just covered them up. But that's not all the sacrifices did. The Hebrew for sacrifice is korban, which means to come near. So somehow the sacrifices allow us to get closer to God, and they also provide food for the priests. So when the Messiah returns and the temple is rebuilt, we will sacrifice again, not to cover our sins, but to remember Yeshua's sacrifice for us and help us care for the priests and get closer to God. So how can we sacrifice to God? How can we get closer to God today? We can sacrifice or give our time to do good deeds to help people. We can sacrifice our time and read and learn the scriptures and pray. These are just a few ways we can sacrifice and get close to God today. Will you sacrifice your time so you can become closer to God this week? Shabbat Shalom. Shavua Tov. Come to abrahamsdescendants.com and check out our kosher comic section called Inside the Bushel and its archives. You'll be glad you did.